So this is definitely going to be a wild week in terms of crypto. There's going to be a lot of volatility, a lot of movement, and hopefully this translates towards some, some positivity in terms of ADA, in terms of the market in general. But we have something to get excited about when it comes to Cardano, because we are officially beginning that transition to the final phase of Cardano. Chang Hard Fork Part 2 is now in the discussion with this deployment that took place over the course of the weekend, and we need to have a little bit of discussion about this. I'm Luxide. Welcome to the channel. If you guys are new or haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that bell again. It's free to do. It'll keep you updated anytime there's new content live here on the channel. So the Voltaire era. Chang hard fork part two, full on chain governance, full decentralization. These are, this has always been the big quest for Cardano. And frankly, it's the completion of the roadmap. And with this launch and deployment that took place this weekend, this is officially the, the, the grains of sand are falling. Now we are officially in, in movement. All right. So what happened was on Saturday, the deployment of Cardano node 10.1.1 did actually happen. So this was a pre-release of this node, and this was in fact being tested out. And we can see that it is currently being adopted on chain. So uh, already 10% of staking pool operators are reporting this new node version 10.1.1. And this does a couple important things for Cardano governance. So first of all, it utilizes CIP 1694, which will terminate the current bootstrapping phase of Cardano and transition us into the next one, where obviously DRAPs actually play a role. Al alongside the latest node release are several improvements to the governance system. This includes support for SBO delegation to pre to predefined voting options. There is also allowance for new Plutus primitive primitives defined in CIP 0122, CIP 0123, and CIP 0127. The other improvements found alongside Cardano node 10.1.1 .1 update the and update involved the ledger, CLI, API, and network code basis. So it may sound like a, a lot of nonsense, right? But it basically takes us from essentially that test phase of governance, the ease into governance to full governance. And like I mentioned, this is where D reps are actually going to be able to partake in voting. And basically away we go. This is where there could actually be things done with the treasury. This is this is fully into the new era when it turn when it comes to Cardano. So this is in fact a very big deal. Now, again, this is this is something that uh People will have questions about, oh, is this something that's going to move price? Is this going to be uh, a pump in, you know, ADA event? And the answer is probably no, right? We saw what uh, Chang Hard Fork Part 2, or I'm sorry, Chang Hard Fork Part, Part 1 did for ADA. And frankly, it didn't really do a whole lot. It wasn't really a focal point of excitement for people outside of Cardano. But it is an important transition because, again, this gets us closer to being able to uh, really tout that full decentralized nature of Cardano. And it's a big thing, again, that some of those enterprises and governance or governments and things like that look for when they're looking to adopt a blockchain. And that brings me to this point. So a, a lot of people, they look for these events. Oh, what's the next event that's going to pump ADA? And as we know now, these events really aren't things that that do that. Even the partnerships, even the adoption, you know, announcements, those haven't really been things that have moved ADA price. And what I think people really need to look more at Cardano and ADA as is a business, which may sound strange because obviously we're moving into full decentralization. But I really want people to think about this, right? We look at something like the stock market. People invest in fundamentals. They don't necessarily invest for price. Yes, we obviously all want price to move. We want ADA to run and do a 20 to 40 X, which I, I still don't think is out of the question in this cycle. Anybody saying it is, you're making calls way too early, way before we even hit some of the biggest adoption times. So we'll have to be patient and let that play out. But the biggest thing I can say is that we've gotten past this point of speculation in terms of ADA. We've gotten past this point of, oh, it might be able to do this. And we're getting into the point of show me, show me, show me. We want to see these things actually taking place. And the things actually are taking place and price will be the last thing that moves. All right. I will say that Cardano during the bear market cycle and even now into the early part of the bullet it has done such a good job of taking major steps forward for the adoption that is going to hit the crypto market. And that's something that frankly, people in the space are kind of sleeping on right now. That's OK. All right. We we don't necessarily need need the people here currently to realize what's going on right now. But there will be a point where they do. 
What is also happening is there are people and entities and governments and businesses outside the space that are paying attention. And those are a big focus of what will be a driver of, of Cardano and a driver of Ada Price as we move down the road. The biggest thing I can say is patience, patience, patience. I still see the comments daily talking about price. Guys, I look at the charts daily, all right? We, we, we talk about these things every single day. And you have to be patient. You have to stop looking at things through such a narrow lens and really open your eyes. Look at all the major things that are taking place in terms of Cardano because they're things that are making it uh, so big that it cannot fade away. I really want people to think about that moving forward here. So this is an exciting time. It is time to get excited. Guys, the election is tomorrow. Make sure you guys vote whatever side you're on. That is your right. Does not matter. But uh, have a great day. Show your love below. Let's kick this week off with an awesome start. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.